Hello. This morning I'm in leafy Isleworth, which is near Twickenham in South London. And I've brought you here because just across the way from this tree, which by the way, I remember was a sapling, no taller than I was the first time I came to this address. I've brought you here because just across the way from the tree is the address where the first story of my new fiction takes place. And right up there, behind that bedroom window, just above my right ear, I spent one of the most glorious afternoons of my life. And that's why I set my first story here. And that's why I've come back to pay homage to that memory and to this tree, which I can remember looking out of the bedroom window at and wondering why it was so small. Um, I first visited this address when I was 15, and for the first time in my life, another man had said to me, would you like to come back to my place? And I'd said, yes. And up there, behind that bedroom window, I spent one of the most glorious afternoons of my life. I learned about pleasure, I learned about affection, and I learned about finally having no fear. And I think so often, we get delivered the familiar tropes of abuse, of danger, of exploitation, of shame, of fear, when a young man meets a much older man. And I wanted to tell the other story about how one generation passes on to another, the bodily lesson of joy. This is such a special place to me. I'm glad the tree has flourished and grown. And I'm glad I'm back here nearly 50 years later. And I hope you'll read the story and find out why that window matters so much to me. Still, thank you. Thank you.